let's meet God today. And uh, let's uh, stand as we uh, read our call, call to worship. Psalm 66, 1 through 4 says this. Shout for joy to God, all the earth. Sing the glory of his name. Give to his glorious praise. Say to God, how awesome are your deeds. So great is your power that your enemies come cringing to you. All the earth worships you and sings praises to you. They sing praises to your name. Let's pray. Dear God, thank you for this opportunity to be in your house today to worship you. We thank you that we can come with a heart of joy, even in the midst of what we might be dealing with in our lives, because you are God. And let us sing uh, with passion now to you as we worship. In Christ's name we pray. Amen. Well, this morning we'll officially kick off our study in James. Uh, last week, Pastor Brian introduced it. This week will be the first week studying through a passage, and we're going to uh, look at the purpose of trials in our lives. Um, so before we do that, it's important to just remember that God is faithful, to reflect on God's faithfulness um, through good times and bad. So that's what we're going to sing about this morning with the hymn, Great is Thy Faithfulness.
each other. to understand what God has will but God has planned I only know at his right hand stands one who is my savior I take him at his word and do Christ died to save me this time. 
Morning everyone. It's good to have you all here. We're doing something a little bit new. We're going to try and do some video announcements um, so that we can uh, streamline and whatnot. So uh, it's good to see you all here. Thanks so much for coming and let's go see what's going on. If you're visiting with us today, make sure you grab one of the visitor cards out of the pew and uh, fill out the information, drop it in the offering plate if you have a prayer request, you can put that on there as well. And you can come by this table out in the lobby and see Pastor Brian and say hello. And if you have one of the Precious Life bottles, um, make sure that you bring that back for next Sunday, fill it up with some spare change, you can drop it off right here at this table. So if you're planning on going to the Curve game, that's coming up here on the 21st, and uh, we're over here by Danny's office, let's drop in and see how he's doing. He's uh, he needs your money though for that game, for those tickets. So here we go. Hey Danny, how you going, man? <laughs> oh man, I'm so sorry, Danny. I, I, I'm, that's, I'm sorry, uh, that's okay. I, I, you know, I'll get one at the Curve game. And by the way, if you want to come to the Curve game, please see me as soon as possible. We've got lots of tickets, so get a hold of me this week or else. Got some youth announcements for you this week. Um, first and foremost, tomorrow is the last day to pay off the remainder of your momentum balance. If you're registered for momentum, paid your deposit, you have to pay off the rest of your balance by tomorrow. Otherwise, the price is going to go up again, and you don't want that, and your parents don't want that. So please pay that off tomorrow. Um, tomorrow is also the beginning of Senior High Week at Camp Manawagon, which is really exciting. I'm going to be there myself, which is going to be awesome. Registration starts at 10 a.m. Um, so make sure you're there between 10 and 11 to register if you're already signed up to go. And also, um, if you're back home, just rem remember to be praying for our students and the staff at the camp. Um, praying that they just have a great week growing closer to the Lord. Uh, this Wednesday, for the junior high kids who won't be at camp, we'll be having the Junior High Amazing Race. It's going to start right here at MGBC out in the parking lot. It starts at 6 and goes until 8.30. Um, so that's anyone who just finished 6th, 7th, or 8th grade. Um, and you're just going to have groups assigned to adult leaders who are going to drive you around the cove on a scavenger hunt. It's going to be awesome. Um, so make sure you're here for that if you're in junior high. Last but not least, there is a detailed calendar for the entire summer that you can pick up at the information desk. So make sure you pick that up so you know what's going on with youth this summer. Back to you, Tim. We have a new check-in system for our children's ministry. Um, and it will begin on June 28th. And if your last name begins with A and goes through M, you will start doing this on the 28th, and then the following week will be N through Z. And we will have certified staff both here and at the table over by the information desk, which I will show you in a moment. And they will help you get checked in. You will have a swipe card, so then the following week you can come in and just check yourself in. This is going to be our visitor station over here by the information desk. For the first couple of weeks, um, it is available to anyone, but we will have a person here staffed, ready to go and get your kid uh, checked in and registered and help them to their classroom. This is our information desk and uh, we have some of these prayer cards for our children's ministry and youth ministries uh, that are left over from last week. We'd love to have you come by here and pick one up and pray for one of our youth throughout this next year. Beginning this Sunday we're going to have a table set up in the lobby across from the information desk for our VBS VBX. Um, this is for volunteers and prayer partners if you would like to sign up this is a kind of a self-serve thing and you can put your name on here and uh, be a part of our ministry for the summer in this week's bulletin make sure you check there are other announcements in there concerning VBS and VBX through incorporated as well as uh, pastor Kurt and his uh, ministry at Metro Grace and you can also check uh, on the prime timers guided walking tour Elders and Ben Smith come up. Ben is going to be going on Operation Barnabas here. When do you leave, Ben? Ben leaves tomorrow morning. So um, he will be in a hot and sweaty bus all summer long, which will be lots of fun for him, I'm sure. Um, so we're going to uh, pray for him as he goes out and does his 